We have new information tonight on a triple homicide on the city's south side. Three people found shot to death at a home in the 800 block of East Lewis Street Wednesday. Police say they were shot multiple times and killed execution style. Here are the victims, 23-year-old Mohammed Taha Omar, 20-year-old Adam Mekki, and 17-year-old Mohanad Adam Tarab. All of the victims are from Fort Wayne. We still don't know much about the victims, but police are starting to give more details about the case. News Channel 15 Sarah Wagner met with department leaders today. She joins us live from Lewis Street with more about what we've learned about the crime today. Sarah. This house at 808 East Lewis Street is where police first discovered those three victims late Wednesday afternoon. Their deaths marked the first triple homicide in Fort Wayne in more than a decade. What? Reason. I mean, what possible reason could you have for killing three people, but what the issue was behind this? It's a question still left unanswered. Two men in their 20s and a teenager taken far too soon. These young people were just starting out in their life and to lose their life. Nobody lived here at 808 East Lewis Street, but police describe it as a party house. It had been a place where young people would go. There was no adult supervision. The Fort Wayne gang unit has also done surveillance on the home before. We were aware that this home had become a problem for the neighborhood. Police say they were familiar with some of the people who frequently came in and out of the house, but not necessarily the three victims. They're also maintaining that these men have no ties to any gang activity. The original call came in as a problem unknown on Wednesday afternoon. Public Safety Director Rusty York says dispatchers did that because there was a language barrier, but they knew it was something very serious. We know that the homicide occurred probably within an hour because we'd talked to folks who had been there a little bit earlier and returned within a short amount of time uh, to find that this had happened. With that many people involved, victims, it's hard for one person to commit that act by himself, so it had to be some other people present. So I'm hoping that someone saw a group of people leaving that residence may have seen something they think may not be important, it may be very important to helping us. Police say retribution is always a concern in cases like this, so they're working, working very hard to make sure that that does not happen. Reporting live from Lewis Street, Sarah Wagner, News Channel 15.